for the highlights Ladies. will be able to capture you in there also providing commentary. Sorry, are going to be facing off versus the Tide Hunter bottom lane. It's going to be. Oh, oh! It looks like uh, that one boss guy. There's a big Reddit thread that has a lot of videos analyzing the new first patch. Blood. That's really good. It's good to see that. So I'm completely missing first blood up top lane. Toby and getting a double kill. Looks like Big Bad Bear Club. He's going to be in trouble if he can't get to this tower, and Undying's not going to get within range. Some rotations coming back in. Terror, what wave of terror, rather? Anyway, gonna scare them away. They're gonna have to reset and find another approach. Haste rune on Billy Bob, moving in on top of Drow. Drow defectively puts the gust out to slow him down. Ventral Spirit, Magic Missile. They're gonna continue to punish him as he heads to the top lane on the Radiant side. Kill there. Fuel Scepter, Ventral up in the air with the Magic Missile on Silencer. Lena taking the Death War damage. It's lethal. Zipcore wandering back in, dangerously close with low HP. But he manages to survive and taking Drow Ranger out. Assassinate on Witch Doctor on the high ground. Silencer getting that kill while Shadow Fiend hanging. Sniper is dealing incredible amounts of damage. 21 to 6, 20 minutes into the game. The laning phase, that, that's where it was lost. I, I would go to say that Undying and Silencer was the combination that they needed. Death Ward up, gonna get to take Tokni out of the game. Yule Scepter on Lina, while Sniper's gonna turn around and try to provide some cover fire, but Billy Bob, he's gonna fall. Tainless has gotta turn around, activating Shadow Blade, but they use the dust to. They're trying to punish Tidehunter. He's gonna switch targets though. He's gotta get the other Requiem. He's gotta open up. Zithcore and Sniper in biggest trouble. Sniper going down, falling to Shadow Fiend. While meanwhile, Lena, lots of right click potential, but the Ravage, first Ravage is off. He's gonna activate the re. Oh, the refresher is up. Second Ravage is out. Zith. Steam. Steamroll right over Fate's hand. There's Je Billy Bob, Jethro Cletus falling. There's one Rax. There's Zoo, yeah. Snipers trying to get so much damage in, but the cheese is activated on Shadow Fiend. He's not able to get the kill. Oh, but he does. The shrapnel does get the Witch Doctor. And a blink. Anchor Smash. Gus. Gush. On top of Silencer. Oh, heading too close into the well draw. Too passive. Dyer's bottom tower is under siege. Radiant's Ancient is under attack. Radiant has fortified its structures. Die in victory. Soviet Reunion winning game one. Unfortunately, Fates and not being able to take that early game momentum, that advantage that they did have within the first 20 minutes of the game and not able to follow up. What an incredible game. So we're going to go ahead. Yeah, yeah. This is that, that that was such a good turn of events. I was not expecting Soviet Reunion to be able to turn that around like they did. That was excellent place.